What's up guys, JB Tech here back with another video and I got great news. Uh, Windows users, you will be able to jailbreak iOS 5 now running on your iDevice. Red Snow has been updated so they have updated it so it can work on Windows and Mac now. So I'll leave the links down in the description bar. It's going to be a link to senseiphone.com. That's where I have uh, written how to. And I'll also have the links to Red Snow for Windows and Mac. So go ahead and check that out. And be aware this is a tethered jailbreak still. The untethered jailbreak, hopefully we'll get it soon, but who knows when we'll get it. Hopefully it should be soon though. So let's get started with this video. All right guys, so once you get Red Snow downloaded, either on Windows or Mac, we'll just go ahead and open it up. And then we will tap on jailbreak. Once you do click on jailbreak, you will make sure, like it says on the screen, make sure it is plugged in. Mine is plugged in. And we will also turn it off. So go ahead and turn off your iDevice. Once your iDevice has turned off, go ahead and we'll set it to DFU mode. To do that, we'll just go ahead and hold down the power button for three seconds. One, two, three and then hold down the home button and power button for 10 seconds. Now you'll let go of the power button, but you'll still be holding down the home button for about, I would say 10 seconds, a little less. As you see here on the screen, you will get all these little exploding to lime rain or exploding with lime rain. All that good stuff will go ahead and run and then you'll see your phone flash white that's normal and then it will be patching kernel and preparing your jailbreak data and as you see it does detect your own firmware now so now we'll just make sure install Cydia is selected and I have jailbroken mine already so I'm just gonna go ahead and uncheck it but you have to make sure you check it. So make sure it is checked. I'm just doing this because I've already jailbroken mine. Go ahead and hit next. And as you see right here on the screen, hello again, as you see me on the screen, it does say download and jailbreak data. And on the screen up there on the computer, it does say upload and RAM disk. That will all process. I'll fast forward this because this will take a while. As you see, that's all normal don't panic if you get that so I will fast forward this now so you won't have to sit through this because it's gonna take a couple minutes so let's fast forward alright guys so since mine was already jailbroken um, I'm just gonna talk to y'all how to basically walk through it so once that does boot back up we will have to go ahead and rerun red snow and use the just boot option because if you notice Cydia does not open up and it has a blank icon and also Safari doesn't work so to fix that we will have to do just boot so to do that we will first have to open up red snow again and then we will go ahead and hit on extras and then you will go up to where it says just boot click on that and then as you see here it will we will have to follow the same procedures as we did when we first jailbroke it so go ahead and turn off your iDevice and then once that is turned off go ahead and set it to DFU mode you will hold down the power button for three seconds and then the home button while you hold down the power button for 10 seconds and then you will again let go of the power button and keep holding down the home button for 15 seconds and then you'll be good to go and then you will get a white screen. I'm going to fast forward this so we won't have to sit through this. Alright guys, so as you see it does boot up now. And we'll just go ahead and slide to unlock. And if you scroll over to Cydia, you will see the Cydia icon available now. Go ahead and open that up. And it will ask you options, user, hacker, or developer. I always choose user, so go ahead and just tap on user. Hit done and then you're done guys you've jailbroken your iOS 5 
on your i device so that's gonna be it for this video guys so go ahead and if you found this video useful informative all that good stuff go ahead and hit that like button down the bottom left and also if you haven't subscribed yet go ahead and hit that subscribe button right up top and leave any questions comments and i'll be glad to help you out in the comment section below and also if you haven't been following me on twitter facebook google plus go ahead and follow me though on those i'll always have my updated videos on there and all that good stuff so uh thanks for watching guys really appreciate y'all and i'll catch y'all on the next video